Bottom of the table at kickoff with just a single point following their worst ever start to a season. Montpellier were looking to put a smile back on their beleaguered fans' faces. It seemed to be a good time to face Monaco after they lost 3-2 to Lyon on Sunday. But Leonardo Jarim's men had lost just once in their last 10 league trips on the road. Roland Kuba under pressure but his side started the match without fear. And it was Monaco's Daniel Subasic that was the busier of the two goalkeepers. Croatian getting Kevin Berigo's strike to safety. But 26 minutes in, and after conceding three at Lorient, the Principality's defence wasn't looking too sharp. They were blunted once again as Daniel Congre turned in after the ball went loose. It was Hilton's header palmed into the path of his centre back partner for Congre's first goal since February 2014. Mustafa Yatabari spent a year in Turkey after a 2 million euros move to Trazanspor, but is yet to score since returning to France on loan at Montpellier. Firing straight at Subasic. Riyad Budbu's delivery led to the first goal and it was his wand of a left that helped Montpellier double that lead. This time no one from the home side got involved. This an own goal after Guedo Carrillo turned his back on the ball. Yet to score in Europe since his 8.8 million euros move from Estudiantes. Montpellier have only beaten Monaco four times in the history of this fixture. Last one came at the Stade louis Du in January 94. The last victory at La Mosson was almost 15 years ago. The host therefore went in hunt of a killer third, but Budbo's five for Bastia last term failing to score there. And the game turned on Fabio Contrao's strike. Portuguese fullback on loan from Real Madrid, grabbing his first goal in France. Keeper should have done better. Monaco came to life. Terrific switch of play. And it was Nabil Derar who was released down the right by Bernardo Silva. And his cross came all the way across the six yard box. Thomas Lamar on hand to equalise for Monaco. Two and two and three for the season for the young Frenchman. Signed for four million euros from Caen. It got even worse for the goalkeeper Jonathan Legali when he took down Contrao five minutes into stoppage time. And Contrao's fellow ex Los Blancos teammate Fabinho stepped up to score the winner as he did against Gazalak Ajaxio. 3 2, Montpellier inconsolable and rock bottom as Monaco snatched all three points right at the death.